Assalamu alaikum and welcome to the sixth video hijab tutorial on how to wear hijab provided by the Canadian Muslim, formerly known as Ishars Online. You can find us at www.thecanadianmuslim.ca. Today we're going through another trendy style that has been out there for actually a few years now. And it's, it involves using a cotton underscarf or a polyester underscarf that you can see here in chocolate, dark chocolate brown, one of my favorites. As, uh, with a polyester shayla, or you can wear any kind of shayla with this style, but it particularly goes well with any kind of patterned shayla, or shaylas with texture, thicker ones meant for winter, or, or chiffon. It can actually go with any kind of shayla. So what I've done so far is I've put on the cotton underscarf, uh, the polyester underscarf, with a safari shayla. You know, we had to bring in safari sometime or another. So here it is. Okay, so the next step is pin, pinning it under the chin. And as you know from videos 1, 2, and 3, it's a very common step when wearing a square hijab or shayla. An exception of video number 5. All right. Okay, so that's the next step. Then the next step is to, I guess, drape this, drape this across the shoulder loosely, pin it on the shoulder here with the oval hijab pin or a secured kind of pin. Be careful of the pins you use because you'll want to take care of your shalas. In all cases, avoid using safety pins. Does it matter what kind of embellishment they have on it? It's still a safety pin. Okay, even the pins that don't have coils, they're still sharp edges and metal. It's not a good, it's not a good thing. Okay, moving forward. I'm going to take the longer side, and before we started this whole, uh, 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 this next bit, this uh, way of wearing hijab, one side was significantly longer than the other. I'd say there's about 33% of the shayla on one side, maybe 30% and then the rest of the length of 70% uh, will be on the other side. Okay, moving forward. Okay, so we're gonna go under the chin, up and around. I know this looks the same, but you'll see what I'm talking about eventually. It's actually referred to as a Kuwaiti style where you just drape it loosely. This, when you wrap it around the second time, it's loosely wrapped around the face and just hangs there. Okay, so we're just going to adjust this. Even though it's loose, you got to try to make it as neat as possible. This style can be easily worn with the one-piece shalas that we have. But it's even nicer when you use a regular shale and create the same effect. Okay. So it's like that. And then the last step is to use a straight pin or an oval pin. And as long as the oval pin matches, you can actually pin it right at the side right here. It's hardly noticeable, especially if it's a black shale. Or you can use a straight pin. And what I find works is that you, you pin it in a vertical, no, no, horizontal, <laughs> horizontal direction like this, okay? And we're going to just move her a bit so you can see how it looks from a different view. It looks quite nice. Give it a try. Have fun. <coughs> we hope you enjoyed this video, and please do shop on our website at thecanadianmuslim.ca. Beautiful pictures guaranteed, and we're a great venue for community, helping each other out in free hijab advice and moral support. Thanks for watching. Assalamu alaikum.